Chicago is world famous for the vast number of impressive buildings representing more than a century of visionary design and we got to see most of them. Greg Dreyer was our docent and he took us aboard Chicago's Classic Lady for a tour on the Chicago River to view from a very unique point, Chicago's breathtaking architecture. The first two buildings, these green glass buildings, uh, are identical and they're called Gateway Center 1 and Gateway Center 2. Designed by Skidmore, Owings and Merrill, 1965 and 1968. Here we have that modernism once again. The Chicago Architecture Foundation River Cruise, among Chicago's First Lady Cruises, is a six miles commentary experience about Chicago's most famous architecture and panoramic buildings. It takes about 90 minutes to be completed. It has been named one of the top 10 things to do in Chicago, and making sure everything is safe and secure is Captain Richard Coster. We'll leave this dock and we'll go down the main stem of the Chicago River, going west. Then we go north to Goose Island, it's about a mile. Then we come back south down to River City, um, and we turn River City, come back, and we come back down the main stem, and we go to the Chicago Lock, so they can see Navy Pier and the lakefront. We turn there, and then we come back to the dock. Chicago is known as the Windy City, and if you're not used to a bit of cold, then Chicago's Classic Lady has a space where you might feel a bit more cozy. Each boat has a carpeted and temperature controlled interior salon with a full service bar. Large oblong windows surround the mahogany tone and brass appointed salon. Among the many architectural significant buildings seen on the cruise are the 180 story Willis Tower, the Trump International Hotel and Tower, and the Civic Oprah Building. For one, the different styles. You know, uh, there's so many different. Uh, uh, in our history, we've had the different architectural styles. We do try to describe those, uh, and uh, also kind of how the city came to be, uh, uh, too. I think that's important uh, because uh, it is a very important, uh, it is a very important transportation center for water and railroads, is the uh, historically, and uh, the city being located in the center of the continent became a very important manufacturing center. So I try to talk about that too. And every building is some tourist favorite. I can't think of a single one. Uh, I've heard various comments. Uh, let's say the, you know, like the 333 West Wacker building with the green glass that kind of hugs the river. Uh, people really like that. Uh, I think they're all very impressed with the Willis Tower as well. Uh, the Willis Tower being our tallest building as well. I think people are just uh, amazed at the views that they have of the, of the buildings from along the river here. Uh, it's a unique perspective. We're below street level, so I think it makes the buildings even more dramatic. And we also have views that people don't get from the street at all because, uh, like on the South Branch over there, we're not along sidewalks or walkways or uh, streets, and so it's a uh, view that they can't get anywhere else. A unique view, so, isn't it? Unique views, yes. That's probably the main thing. The Chicago Architecture Foundation is a non-profit organization dedicated to inspire people to discover why design matters. The foundation pursues this mission through architecture tours and exhibition, among others. Chicago really is a showcase of American architecture, and uh, that's, uh, it, I think that's, that's kind of what we're known for. People come from all over the world to see our architecture, and I, I, I am uh, very, uh, I really enjoy telling people about uh, the city's architecture and uh, meeting people from all over the world. I really do enjoy that. We try not to make it boring. <laughs> yeah, and we try to uh, uh, describe the architecture in, in, in terms that most people would understand too. I enjoy doing this, it's a lot of fun. For more information about the tour and how you can get a chance to be part of it, you can visit www.cruisechicago.com or www.architecture.org.